Hello Capricorn, welcome to your Taroscope Energy Reading for March 2024, or whenever you're watching this. This is intended to be timeless. This is for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, or Rising. Sit back, relax, close your eyes if you feel guided to, allowing the messages to come forth as they're supposed to, as spirit intends. <clears throat> taking only what speaks directly to your soul and releasing what doesn't. So the card that I pulled for you this month is the Four of Cups. In the Moonchild Tarot, this card means, as our own reflection fades into shadowed obscurity, it can be difficult to see the world around us as a place of support. This card speaks of the tormented emotional states that can often impair our grasp on reality, when depression, self-pity, or sadness sink in and we retreat into our own world, our sensations and feelings can be overpowering and illusionary. We may feel lost, hopeless, or even complacent, which may be an indication that we should consider our emotions head-on and examine the roots of our anguish. If you are fearful or indifferent about making a change, you may continue to dwell in a perpetual state of limbo. This card may also suggest that there is something you are overlooking. Perhaps a solution is closer than you think. You have a system of love and support in your life. How can you connect with this? It may be time to shift your perspective beyond this clouded veil. So the Four of Cups is about shifting your perspective from what has been lost to what is still there. What has been lost is the problem. What is still there is the solution. The message that I channeled for you is shifting your focus. So how can you do that? How can you shift your focus? <clears throat> so let's tap into the energy for this month for Capricorn, Sun, Moon, or Rising on shifting your focus. What can you tell us, please? Thank you. Okay, things are moving forward, but they're moving very slowly. The Eight of Pentacles shows me that you have been working on yourself and you now see this, this, this situation, this person, this relationship in a different light. You're seeing it for what it is and that's a huge, that's huge growth. So what does that mean? It means you're not focusing on the problem anymore. You're not focusing on the heartbreak. What you're doing instead, and that is not flipping the camera around is you are shifting from three of swords to the fool. <clears throat> the fool is telling you it's time to take a leap of faith. So shifting your focus to the solution, taking a leap of faith, moving forward, what is that going to bring to you? What is coming up or what will come up? It's going to bring you the seven of wands. It's going to bring you many options on how you can resolve this. You're going to find the strength to allow spirit to show you. I'm hearing go into full surrender. Allow yourself to find the strength to find peace with whatever solution comes through, knowing you're going to be okay. Your guidance is to listen to your heart, listen to your intuition, listen to what you know to be true. When you do that, you're going to bring in your 10 of cups and your 10 of cups is what you know is for you. Not as what you think is for you or what you're told is for you. You are going to choose you in this situation. And by choosing you, how is this going to get the month going? It's going to balance the scales. There's going to be a karmic release. So something that maybe you have been in limbo for for a very long time is finally going to resolve itself or you're going to answer yourself the question you have been asking for a very long time. Should I stay? should I go? It is not in a gray area. It is very black or white. It is very much you shifting from eight of swords to eight of pentacles and then going to the eight of cups and then to the eight of wands. So the eight of swords is about fear, bounding yourself in fear. You have unbound yourself in fear. You are in eight of pentacles currently. You're working on yourself. You're working on the situation. You're seeing a new perspective. Once you get into justice, you will get into the Eight of Cups where you will evolve past it and then shift into the Eight of Wands where you will move forward. 
And moving forward <clears throat> is going to bring you the Three of Wands, where you are looking ahead, you are not looking back, and you are not second guessing any decisions that you have made because you know you have made all the decisions you need for you. So I do hope that this energy reading has brought you clarity and guidance and has helped you in some way. If it did, please drop a comment below to let me know. <clears throat> please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And if you are subscribed to my channel, please make sure to hit the bell notification so you are notified when new content is posted on my channel. If you are interested in booking with me, go to butterflyintuition.com. You can get the link to my website, see my full list of services, and all the ways you can connect with me outside of YouTube in the description box below. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being a subscriber. Many blessings to you. Love and light.